I'm the proud owner of a septic system, so I know firsthand the importance of keeping the system running well so it saves me money in the long run. I'm here at a friend's house and we're gonna take a look around his yard and show you tips you can do to keep your system running great. The first step is to find out what kind of system you have. Finding out what kind of system you have can be as easy as checking out the public health website on your phone. There are several different types and each has different needs. Do you have a gravity system? A pressure distribution system? Mound system? It may sound complicated, but it's not. Hey look, my friend Ken has a compliant system and it's a mound system. I can see that right here on the webpage. The next step is to make it easy to maintain your system. You can do this a couple of ways. First, find a local company that can take charge of your maintenance. Set up an annual inspection and have them pump your tank as needed. And that can be anywhere from two to five years. Having an inspection helps you know when it needs to be pumped. Putting off an inspection can result in very expensive system failures. So be proactive. And that is money I could spend on something more important, like plants. Speaking of plants, although grass is usually used over drain fields, lots of shallow rooting perennials work depending on your system. Our native wild strawberries and most wildflowers can work. This meadow in the forest is actually a mound system. Best to check with your septic designer because these may not work in all areas. Our native ground covers like sword fern and woodland sorrel would also work on a septic system. By keeping your system's inspection ports easily accessible, it makes it really easy to see how your drain field's doing. Hello? Hello? It's doing great. If your system already has easily accessible risers where you can access your septic tank or pump tank, it makes your life a breeze. If you don't have them, you might consider having them installed because it makes it so much easier for the, both the inspector and yourself to see how your system is doing. Make sure your septic lids are tight and secure though because you don't want kids or pets toppling into that nasty tank. Your septic tank has billions of microbial employees in there breaking down waste. Keep these microbes happy and healthy by avoiding harsh cleaners, septic additives, and garbage disposal use. Using a garbage disposal can fill your septic tank prematurely and result in more pumping. Instead, compost the material and use it in your garden. Mm -hmm.